Acumatic just has a tremendous amount of flexibility when it comes to reporting. In the finance area, you have the ability to manage multiple budgets. So if you have a revised budget, revised one, two, three, four, it's no problem. You can get all of those budgets created throughout the year and include those in your financial reporting. So let's see how you do that. The first thing that we're going to do is go over to finance and then we're going to go into the configuration area and I want to go to ledgers. So you can see in this company we have an actual and a budget set up and I want to create a revised budget. So I'll click on my plus sign and then I'm going to add RevBud for my revised budget. And then I want to confirm that this is a budget set of buckets rather than actual. We'll click Save. Now you can see I've got my budget and I have my revised budget. So rather than entering a revised budget from scratch, I can do a couple of things. I could take my actual ledger or I could take my previous budget and rather than re-entering everything, I'm going to export it to Excel, make the adjustments that I know have happened through the year and then I'm going to import it. And that makes it a lot faster for managing those kind of mass changes. Let's get our export done and to accomplish that I'm going to go over to work area. Then I'm going to go look at my budgets and I'm going to bring in my original budget and let's bring that in. Oh, we'll pick 2013 for this example. I know it's got a lot of data in it. Once I have this budget in front of me, then it's just as simple as clicking on the Excel button and it's going to drop it out to an Excel spreadsheet where I can make the adjustments that I need quite easily, applying formulas or whatever makes sense. Once that's created, then all I do is just open up that spreadsheet and in this case, let's change this number here on period two and let's add in, let's say here, another $500,000 onto this line item. So we'll be looking for that land and buildings on period two to be up a half million dollars. And I'm going to reflect that in my total amount as well. And then all I do is I just save that work. I'm going to do a file save as, and we'll call this new budget. Then the last thing I'm going to do, I'll close this off and now I want to get this budget import. And so I'm going to tell it that I want to create this revised budget bucket. Answer yes. You can see here it's setting here without anything in it at all. And then I click on the upload, choose my file. And I want that one that's called new budget that we just created. Tell it to upload. Take the defaults. The mapping is already established for me because I started with an extract. That always makes it faster and easier for you. Then you can see up here it's processing through. And there we go with our brand new budget with that half million dollars in the land and building. It's as simple as that. Acumatica just does a great job of letting you have these multiple budgets and now I can make whatever adjustments I might want to in my financial reporting and show this year actual to this year current budget as well as this year revised budget. It's your choice.